Howdy folks, I'm Score, the Crimson Renegade, welcome back to Genome. We're about to continue the next mission after we finish the Canyon Maze, we're now going to do the next mission, Chapter 2, Mission 4, called Egger. We're going to start throwing eggs at people's houses. No, that's not what's happening. General Wilkins filled me in on the genome situation. By the way, I, I thought the thing talking. Stop it, but first, we need to get to Mesa Karakon. No, first we need to get you a mech. Let's hit the repair base at Chojaturk. I'm advising caution, though. There's usually a patrol at the entrance. What are we going to do with a broken down hawk from a repair bay? Not a thing. We're going to steal the patrol. Steal the patrol? Uh-huh. Well, okay, sure. Why not? This is an Egger. Enhanced gamma radiation rifle. Doesn't damage a vehicle, but takes out any life form that's inside. We'll rendezvous near the repair bay. Do not draw the patrol's fire until you hear from me. Are we clear on this? Okay, so what we're going to be doing here is, is uh, Thane, Dr. Thane, doesn't have her own vehicle. So, she has to get her own vehicle. In order to do that, she's going to basically use a, I usually say a quicker version of the, um, of the Gasher, called, it, called the Egger. Um, the Gasher, what it does, it, when you, as you've seen, it knocks the, the uh, pilot out of a vehicle and makes the vehicle able to be uh, reused after a few moments. What the Egger does, it's more advanced than that. When it hits a vehicle, instead of ejecting the pilot out of the vehicle, it kills them instantly, allowing the pilot, and, and, and doesn't, uh, doesn't activate the ejection system, so you can actually get inside the vehicle right away. You don't have to wait. Now, unfortunately, I don't have the Egger. Thane does. So what I have to do is I have to uh, draw the Hawk toward me, toward, well, toward me and Thane, essentially. And then Thane is going to haul ass toward the, toward the, uh, uh, the Merc vehicle, use the Egger on it, and that's how she's going to commandeer her vehicle. So, a little bit of uh, uh, coordination with a kind of buggy AI is going to make this mission a little difficult, but we'll give it a shot. No pun intended, of course. Uh, as you can see, primary help things through Merc Patrol. So what we're going to do is we're going to start here. We're going to spawn here. Uh, waypoint one, uh, waypoint two is where the Merc is going to be. Waypoint one is where Thane should be. So we're going to we're going to go, we're going to come either but probably going to go between these mountains. I don't want to get close to this river here because I believe there's some mechs, some merc mechs on this side of the river. I think so. I'm going to go between these mountains here if I can, and I'm going to go toward uh, toward waypoint two. She should spawn here near waypoint one, and then I'm going to use my long range weapons to draw a merc tech defense hawk from waypoint two to my direction. Once it gets close enough, I should, I'm going to signal Thane to go ahead and attack the target. She should haul ass toward the vehicle, use the Egger on it, get inside, mission accomplished. Again, sounds simple. Gotta deal with some AI issues, though, so hopefully I don't have to deal with them too much. Here we go. Alright. Of course, you have to deal with, you know, lots of enemy vehicles. So we got we got two vehicles in front. we got a Merc, two Merc Sentry Hawks right in front of us we got to deal with first. So we're gonna go this, but we're gonna go this way between the mountains. And once we once we clear the mountains, the uh, Merc the Merc sentries will probably be on our left. Now the thing about this is Thane is going to be on foot, so she is vulnerable to being killed. So you have to be uh, kind of wary about that. You got to make sure that doesn't happen, obviously. I shouldn't use too many of my long-range rockets, considering I'm going to be uh, using them to try to draw that Merc attack defense off to me a little bit. Ready. Use the same kind of technique as I did when I was in the Sentry Hawk to take on uh, this Sentry Hawk. Just keep shooting him until he's dead. Which, I mean... Spin, just keep spinning around him and then keep shooting him until he's dead, so... Well, that's the strategy with everybody. Keep shooting until they're dead, obviously. But we'll have a bit of an advantage because he's got a turn. Or, or, or we're we're pretty much evenly. There's not much of an advantage. They both have a turning torso. I like the attack the uh, Merc tactical defense hawk, which doesn't have a turning turret. So hopefully Kylie arrives here in a minute, giving me a little bit of a hand. I'm trying to save my rockets. That rocket should be trying to fire. It's got close range thinking these rockets because they don't they won't lock on them. Oh, there we go. Come on. There we go. Now my now my lasers are hitting. 
Okay, his le his right arm his, his right arm gun is gone, so he's got one left weapon to shoot us with. Uh, his, his torso is extremely damaged, so he should probably fall any moment. Come on now, Jesus! I think you just fall already. I have to just. I'll wait till I just charge you some extra damage. There we go. Right, the other one's already heading my way, I believe. He's probably not going to attack because he's stuck behind the mountain, so I'll have to take this sentry mech on myself. No big deal. There's another mech, there's another uh, enemy vehicle to the right. I'm going to assume it's across the river. I'll take a quick peek as I spin, spin around here. Yep. Spider mech. That's what I was worried about. Ready. As long as that, that spider mech doesn't come my way, I should be alright. Turn my turtle a little bit this way. Reduce to half speed. Do some speed a little bit more since we're losing uh, shields, a little more energy to transfer the shields. Those pulse cannons going. I'm gonna fire at full power to get as much damage as I can, so I'm pretty damaged. Damn it! Alright. Where is he? And pop! Alright, where did you go? You're around here somewhere. There you are. Ready. Ready. My shots are in the mountain. Ready. Again, bad hitboxes in this game. Ready. 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 All right. Because I don't trust that mech, I'm not going to stay in it. I don't trust that the da especially the damage that mech has dealt or has been dealt to. It. Well. I don't know. Maybe I can. Maybe I can handle it. Center. I dealt a, a extreme amount of damage to that mech, and it's not going to take much for it to die. And since it is a merc mech, I am going to be vulnerable to to being killed while inside it. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to go ahead and get in. Get the, get the full HUD here, as always. I'm going to take this mech around to Kylie. Actually, it's not as damaged as I thought it was. It is missing an arm. But the hull is still... Okay, alright, that's not missing an arm. Okay, I'll, get, I'll get and give this a shot. Give this a try. I got no rockets, all I have is my main my main weapon, my main uh, uh, laser pulse cannon. I need to head to waypoint 2. So, what do we got out here? Right, there's the mech we're looking for. That one right there, on, like I targeted, that is the... Uh, the mech I need to I need to uh, draw toward me. That's a lot of Mason towers. Oh my God! Holy hell! Oh, shit, I'm already being fired at. Yeah, that was a Mason blast. Whoa! Holy hell! Oh my God! Please have him draw the mech. The mech's not moving. Damn it! Okay, this is going to be a problem. All right, I gotta somehow draw the diff the t the the mech. All right, let me see if I can get to waypoint one. Let me switch to waypoint one real quick here. Yeah, this is waypoint one. Okay. All right. The mech's still not approaching. Okay, I'm going to see what I can do about ducking and dodging the uh, Mason Towers. And get close enough to at least draw the tack mech to me. Or at least get close enough, maybe I can shoot it. Okay, I think I'm being, yeah, I'm being fired by the tack, tack, the merc, the tack mech. Which is what I want. Now I just got to play dodge and weave. And hope that he's got bad aim. Of 
on, Thane, where are you? Ooh, ouch. Oh! Okay, that was scary. I was walking through my legs. Alright, I'm gonna get out. I'm not gonna take a risk. Good good call. One more hit was about to go down. God damn it, 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 damn it. Okay, that's okay. That's alright. I was close. I was close. I almost had it, but I've got to figure it figured out. I know what to do this time. Okay, no big deal. Obviously, both those... Uh, I figured out the, the trigger there. Again, issue with the programming of the game. Thane wasn't spawning. She should have spawned at waypoint one. The reason she didn't spawn is both of those Merc sentry mechs were still alive. Or, well, okay, well, at least one of them was because I was in control of one. Both those... Mer the reason you heard from Thane just as I died is because both those Merc sentry hawks had to be destroyed. So as soon as that second one went down, Thane spawned. So... I have to kill those two mechs first. So I'm going to definitely need Kylie to at least draw the fire of one of them. Okay, so let's go ahead and do this again. Go ahead and launch this again. Alright. Sometimes you have to learn how the game is programmed before you can play it. Not really. You're not supposed to have to do that, but... I'm on six. Over. So we're going to try this again. This time we'll get it right. Um... <clears throat> We need to kill both the uh, Merc mechs. We actually need to make sure they're both dead and destroyed. We can't actually occupy one. So if we do, we need to go ahead and, go ahead and um, self-destruct it. Alright, I should draw him to me. If not, this rocket will. Okay, let's do this then. That'll send him out there first. Let him go out, there, go out front. Let him draw their fire. At least I'll be a surprise when I show up. Full throttle. That's exactly what I'm going to do. I'll give him a hand, of course, but... Okay, the other one's attacking as well. All right. Reduced half speed to conserve energy. Legs damaged, so I should get he should be destroyed soon. There he is. Excellent. Got a little bit of leg damage here, so I'm going to turn opposite sides so my other leg and take the front of the front of the hits. Okay, the, the Merc Hawk is pissed off. Hawk Cruisers have been triggered. No way I would have died that quickly in normal circumstances. The Hawk Cruiser has to have been triggered. There's no way I would have died that quickly. My legs were dead damaged. Okay, I am dead. Or uh, the, the, the that Beck is dead. The Mark Hawk's not around. Okay, whatever. Meanwhile, Copy. I'll back off here. Let Kali kill that because it needs to be destroyed. I should trigger Thane. There she is. Alright. I can do that. But what I'm going to do in but what I'm going to do. Eject. I'm gonna take your mech, because I need it. What the fuck is that noise? Oh. Other than annoying. Damn it, I get it on both inside and outside of you. Damn it. 
I apologize for that irritating sound. Alright. I need to draw the fire of that. So I have to play dodge and weave with the Mason Towers Yings or anything from distance. Mason Towers are turning. Alright, I got the I got his attention. Now I gotta wait dodge I'm gonna switch views here. Turn the camera around here. Try to dodge any enemy fire that I can dodge. Oh, I just barely dodged that gas cannon. Come on, Thane. This is all on you. Thane, attack target. All right. She should be heading straight for the. Damn it. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. I'm gonna try this again. I'm on six. Over. All right. This time, I definitely want to make sure I keep this mech alive. This mech needs to stay alive at all costs because I need that long-range rocket in order to draw uh, the me draw that mech away. Because trying to dodge the mech and all those Mason towers is just too much. So. I have 26 long-range rockets, oh, so I'm going to see if I can do about drawing those uh, sentry mechs to me first. So, let's move see around here, get into range of that that one there. Stopping. Do a little, uh, what I used to call in CD Heroes, uh, pulling. I want to pull that mech to me. Hopefully just pull them one at a time. Kyle. Copy. Attacking. And just do my best to keep this mech as as functional as possible. Stop me. Get out of the way, Kylie, and I can shoot. Let me get around the the hit box of the mountain. I'm out of my short range rockets. Good god, that mech is almost totally red. Alright. Kylie, go fetch. Kylie's drawn most of its fire, so now I can just get around Kylie. Ready. Take a few shots at the t at the Merc Mech. Alright, we're going slow speed to get my, get my power up. Because of the <laughs> another problem is the width of this mech. Is the weapons are actually wider, the, the pulse cannons are actually wider than the blue mech I'm shooting at. That's ah, just great. 
So I'm actually shooting. I'm actually missing the mech because the, I'm actually it's too wide. Okay. Damn. Okay. Took a lot of damage, but I got it. I still have plenty of rock, long range rockets left. I'm not going to worry about the uh, Dark Hawk Cruiser. Stop. I'm going to get my shield. I'm going to stop so I can get my shields restored. And now that both mechs are down, we should hear from Thane pretty soon. Come on, Thane, where are you? Why didn't you spawn? Both those mechs are dead. Why didn't you spawn? I'm going to see what happens if I try luring the Merc Tech Defense mech now. That should draw him toward me. We're going to start backing up now. <laughs> Ow. Come on, Thane, where are you? God damn it. Things are gonna fucking spawn. I don't know why. Come on, come on, come on. I can't run very fast and my leg is damaged. Thing. Broadcast. Well, I'm out. <laughs> and I'm dead. Try it again. Really? There we go. Now we hit it. <laughs> For fuck's sake. <laughs> All right. Center. Full throttle. Kyle. Copy. Attacking. All right. Kylie, go get it. Yeah, he still wants to come after me. Son of a bitch. It's not good. Yeah, that's right. Draws fire. Thank you, Carly. Come on. Leg damage. With, those, with, the, with both of those bottom legs damage, it's like it's got a, it looks almost like an eight or an ATST chicken walker in a way. Those really skinny legs. Or it's like somebody with really skinny legs with their pants pulled up <laughs> above their knee. <laughs> All right, I get the other one now. Very, very little damage done to me, so I'm okay with that. Let's see if he can go get it. He got some damage to his left leg, so it's not really good, but. Closer. Oh, he wants to come after me. All right, fine then. Ready. Only one of you here. I should be able to do this. Ready. 
Keep firing my primary cannons. Hope I don't get damage taken from Kylie if he's trying to shoot the, the Merc mech. That would suck. <laughs> now he's, he's down to chicken leg mode now, even though we can't see it on our HUD for some reason. I can see it. I can see his mech. His left leg is severely damaged. Ready. Shouldn't last a lot longer. And come on. Both. Now he's in double chicken leg mode, or his, or his pants pulled up mode, whatever you want to call it. There we go. Okay. Thane, it's up to you now. Come on, Thane, where the hell are you? I mean, I can't make him go to my waypoint, but oh well. Kylie. I'm on six. Over. Waypoint two. Stopping. Center. All right. Both of us are here. Waypoint one. Okay, what the hell? I don't I don't get it. I really don't. Hitting the spider mech now. Yep, now he's now he's moving. Okay. Ready. All right, give me a hand here. Copy. Attacking. Trying to die if you can, though, Kylie. <laughs> Okay, that scared me. Damn, I got to charge a little bit more. Okay. I don't know if I've got a kill this thing too. I, I don't... I, there's both the, both the sentry mechs were down earlier. Oop. Okay, let's close. Let's back up a little faster. Luckily, he doesn't lead his target. He doesn't lead his target, so... Finally, I don't know what the hell did. What the hell the trigger was, but whatever. Drop back toward me. The rifle's charged. I'll be ready. Okay, whatever. So I need to, I need to drop back toward her position. Clear. There we go. Stop. Start backing up now. Because I got long enough range rockets, I should be able to draw them to me. One and two. Alright, here he comes. Yep, he's on his way. I haven't taken any damage with this vehicle. There's very little if I have any, so it should be a pretty easy thing to do. 
Alright, Thane, it's close enough to me. Damn. Go. Attacking target. There she goes on the right hand side of the screen. She missed, I think. Come on, Thane, hurry up. Damn it, Thane, hurry up. I'll um I'll I'll try it again in the next episode of Genome. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Check out the links at the end of this video for games that don't have fucked up AI and fucked up controls as bad as this game that I have played on my channel. And other fun stuff that I've done on my channel. Things that make me smile. For a happy reason, not smile and attempt to contain my rage. Yeah. I'm Scorth, the Crimson Renegade. I'll see you later.